Still using Windows 10? Well, time's ticking. Microsoft is ending support this October. No more updates, no more security patches, nothing. But here's the twist, your PC might not be officially supported for Windows 11. So what now? Throw it away. Absolutely not. In this video, I'll show you exactly how to install Windows 11 on unsupported hardware, step by step, no complicated tools, no risky hacks, just a clean, safe install that works like a charm. If you want the sleek look, performance upgrades and future proofing of Windows 11 without buying a new computer, then you need to watch this till the end. Let's break the rules and give your old PC a brand new life. As you can see, I'm currently running Windows 10, and it does not support Windows 11 system requirements. But you're now going to upgrade it to latest version of Windows 11. First, we have to download ISO file of Windows 11. To do that, open your browser and search for Windows 11 ISO. Then go to Microsoft website and scroll down to ISO section. From drop-down menu, select this one and click download. Choose your language and click confirm. Now click 64-bit. You can see it has started downloading. Once the ISO is downloaded, right-click on it and click Mount. Then click OK. It will create DVD file on PC. Now open this PC and you will see folder like this. Remember, name of this drive. In my case it's E, your might be different. Now open command prompt and run it as administrator. Now type the name of DVD file you have remembered, then press enter. Then type setup xce slash product server, then press enter. You can see that window 11 setup has been started. You will see install windows server here. Just click next and follow all steps. Now, the installation has been started. You can see we have successfully installed Windows 11 on unsupported hardware.